So here we are at 110. This is the outside area. Looks like plenty of space. This is where we are located right at the end of, I believe that's Sarasota. It is, corner of Sarasota and Miami. The pool looks like it needs some cleaning, but then they just had checkout yesterday. So um, I'm sure they have a pool company. The surface of it looks, oh, I know what that is, it's sand probably. <laughs> probably just needs to be cleaned all right so let's go in before we do that I'll show you you had mentioned exactly where this was because you had driven up and down the street knowing that they are building two houses down so that's the one that's currently being built and then this is the next door neighbors so that one day that'll be gone too I'm sure and a big house will be coming in there's beach access right down the way. That room is has been turned into a theater room and you have the upstairs balcony, two different places on the second level and then one on the third. Stucco looks to be in good condition. They may have painted it since they built in 2009. Floors look like in, they're in good shape also. Here's the room that they have converted from the garage. And one of those is probably a sleeper sofa. So this is a, a gathering space. Here's your powder room on the main floor, but it's also a shower. Looks like caulking's good. And then your kitchen and living. Here is your view from the kitchen area. So you seat 10 at this table. It's a wine rack on the end. And then you seat four at the bar and four over there on the round table. And I've gone through all of the cabinets, lots of kitchen items, dishes, etc. Lots and lots and lots of them. And glasses and silverware just to show you a few there is a cooktop or a range with flat cooktop two dishwashers a drawer microwave here is an ice machine I don't know if it works it's not turned on and here is a Frigidaire Frigidaire gallery refrigerator. Look at these cabinets. Oh, there's your pantry for your food items. So let me go show you the kitchen from this view. There's the TV and your uh, more living space. They've got a microwave on a table there. There's even space if you wanted to put another table here. And then there is one bedroom on this level, King, with its own ensuite bath. Tile floors. Oh, and I, just a little thing. The uh, exhaust fan doesn't work in that bathroom. And then here's your closet. Nice big walk-in closet and then you have access to the back from this bedroom and also from that living space. It's just another outdoor area to enjoy. There's your grill. Looks like there's a uh, fire pit. Alright, so let's go upstairs. Second level is six bedrooms third level is four bedrooms and then there's one down here so total of 11 bedrooms that looks like an older HVAC and then the hot water heater I don't know I can't get back in there but there are a lot of HVACs around the house um, the only thing I see really is some paint needing to be done in areas some painting 
I like the tile on the risers and then the, the tops of them are wood and that would be an easy, easy paint job at some point. But again, it's a rental. So rentals do have wear and tear. So there's a few little scuff marks, etc. Here's a bunk room that has, let's see, it has two queen, two fulls and two twins. TV on the wall there. Which that would be hard to watch that TV if you're in bed. It would actually need to be there. Here is a bathroom for the twin bed or the bunk room. And maybe for this room, this is kind of a weird set up so it'd almost be like for teenagers or I, I don't know somebody that probably not adults because they're each queen, queen beds so you have this one with your own closet but then you go in to this room and the only way into this room is through that other queen bedroom but this one also has its own bathroom so it's it's doable it makes sense Probably not for two adult groups, two adult families. And that one, they've got the, the TV plugged into the wall in there. So that wire would drive me crazy. I'd have to camouflage it on the wall. This is where one of the HVACs is. And you can see that the door is scraping on here. They need to do something about that. It's just a protective covering of the pipe, but still. It's weird. I think this one was 2016, so that's newer. And then there's another HVAC here. And this one also, I think, is 2016. Yeah, it says 2016. Another king room. With its own ensuite bath. Closets. And access to the balcony. And this one's the one that has the little seating area out here, too. Oh, there's two lights. Let's see. I need two hands to do that, so it's one of those you have to lift up on the handle and then push it. So I'll just show it to you from here. Okay. Not a lot of furnishings around, a few paintings. There are probably no, no colors on the beds because of COVID to keep everything safe and healthy. There are two uh, cabinets back behind that lamp. Washer dryer. Looks like a newer um, washer and an older dryer with cabinets. Here's another king bedroom with its own balcony overlooking the pool. Another ensuite bath. And closet. Another cute bunk room with two uh, queens, I mean two fulls and two twins. And there is a TV on the wall there. And this one has its own bath. Go up to the top level. Show you the sconces they have on the walls going up. Here's one of the king rooms up here. Heater. I think this one's the original. It says 2008. Uh, 
Another cane. Yes, that bed again. Private balcony overlooking the pool. Can't hear the water today. It's calm, yellow flag day. Another king with a closet and ensuite bath. The room sizes are really large. Lots of space, which is nice. This is strange because you have two HVACs. There's one, and it looks older. I can't find any dates on it. And then right next to it is another. So I don't understand. Maybe it's for this this wing of the house, this room, and then the that one there is for the rest of the, the upstairs. I don't know. And here is another laundry on the top level. And then you have a game room, ping pong table, games, TV, refrigerator, wet bar and your bathroom. And looks like an owner's closet. Can't get in there. And that is it. So let me get this video to you. Bye.